everybody, my name is Merstag World, and welcome to this info video. In the background, you will see some Alpine Online gameplay, and of course, we're going to talk about this amazing game. So, what will have been changed in the past days? Well, at least we know the release date is going to be in like one or two weeks, so that's amazing, right? I cannot wait when this game actually comes out, and that's pretty amazing because Alpine Online will I think be the new next awesome game for Roblox and everybody knows that the map is of course given to mode Rook of course made it a lot better and then Moji is gonna finish it and keep it going after a while because of course Rook is really busy with stuff so you can see we just try to spawn in this game and uh, if you wonder how I can join yes uh, only certain people can join the alpha stage so this is still the alpha stage this is not the complete game I repeat this is not how the game is gonna look like but this was in alpha so anyway, we're gonna talk about more stuff. So Rook is really busy with Sword Art Online Burst and of course his internship at uh, Roblox Studios. And that means he has not all the time to work on this game. So he gave it to Moats and Moats, Master of Elements, of the Elements, has the game Sword Art Online project in Eternity. And of course everybody knows he is really good at making that game and he has actually... That's why I probably get the game because Rook is really impressed by it, how his game works. And that's why probably... He trusted Modes to work on his game, and I think Modes is the right person to do that. Of course, there may be a little bit of downsides. Rook is not going to be completely active on this game anymore, and that's maybe a little bit of downsides. Who knows? Who knows? But it w maybe, maybe it will, and maybe it will not. So let, well, hold on, one second. Set key. Uh, Z. Uh, sheet X. Oh, that's yeah. Anyway, so yeah, you can see Alpha stage was pretty amazing. This is still Alpha. We're gonna use some magic at this lion. And you can see these lions are actually from floor 7. But these lions are animated. And that's why I think they are way, way better. So let's uh, join this fight and try to kill this lion. But anyway, we're gonna talk about more stuff. You guys, you can of course watch this in the background. So what will it mean for the future for this game that mode is gonna take it over? I think it will be a nice thing. That mode has it. A lot of people are of course scared that the game will become third first person only. No, it won't. Permadeath? No, it's just the normal death system. He only changed it, you know, a little bit of the map and Rook did the most of the game. So guys, you don't have to be scary that anything is gonna change on that. Uh, people that think you can already join by the password. Nobody knows the password besides Rook and Modes. Everybody who claims that knows the password is completely false about it. Uh, more stuff, yeah, of course, more maps there will be. Territories, yes, I hope the cat sift gets added. I'm gonna ask Mode for some secret stuff that I'm not allowed to know, and you guys are either. But everybody is just hyped for this game. A lot of people are uh, annoyed by you have to wait that long to play the game, but I think it's completely worth the wait, because how long you wait, how better the game will be. Of course, remember, people are busy, they are real people. They cannot make a game within a month. Look at... Just look at Fallout 4. It, they started to work on it when it was out, when Fallout 3 was out. If you're gonna type in the release date, you're gonna be amazed how long they took it. Skyrim it takes forever, to, took them forever to make the L, new Elder Scrolls game. And that's, you know, it's something you need to remember. People cannot make a game within a few minutes. And forget, don't forget that this is Roblox, it's different, it's harder sometimes. You know, Roblox physics updates every time. They break, they do other stuff with it. And guys, just keep that in mind. It's not that easy. It's not that easy as you think. But I'm sure Mode will do a great job with this game. And this game is gonna be super amazing. And we should just all be hyped for this game. Uh, I think dungeon raiding will be an amazing feature that will be added to this game. Like just like Alfine in general, he just make it I think they're gonna make it like Alfheim. And I ho hope the party system works that good. You can actually teleport from floor to floor. And that would be something pretty hard to make for them, I think. If you, you now join at the same time. But if they nail that correctly, everything is done for this game. Maybe a little bit more of animations. And the game will be done. More weapons. Maybe uh, a system. You know, that's... I don't know, maybe a system for the wealth of your empire and you know, you can overthrow the 
queen or king who is currently leading you need like a certain group of people to uh, put a raid on if if the king is like not online for for a week or something he gets kicked out his new player will be selected you know by play hours uh, there's a lot of asking of course and that will take forever and it seems like this teleporter doesn't link anymore damn it <laughs> But yeah, guys, I hope you, of course, learned a little bit of this and maybe be hyped a little bit more because this game is going to be amazing. Don't forget that. Don't forget that. This game is going to be super amazing and it's worth the wait. So, guys, if you all enjoyed and want to see more, please say it with me. One, two, three, and teleport work. Peace out. Yeah. <laughs>